although I wish I had your childhood, at the same time, maybe I became successful because of, of certain things that I grew up with. Yeah, well, listen, my, my whole life was not uh, uh, rosy by any uh, stretch. What wasn't stretch rosy of, about it? Well, I mean, you know, it's what all of us go through, you know, when we journey through this barren sod, this veil of tears. Yeah. Um, loss. You've dealt with a lot of loss. Yeah, you know, you, you, you know, you, you, there are those moments of great doubt, great moments when you really feel like, you know, fuck it, I'm going to commit suicide. You get the fuck out of here. You thought about that? Yeah. Really? Sure. You got that dark? Yeah. And how did you get out of that? You meet somebody and <laughs> you fall in love. And uh, romance got me out of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I mean that's that's dark. I mean, I've I've had thoughts like that where I'm driving and I'm like, well, if my car goes over a bridge, I you know so be it. You know, and I'm like, why are you thinking like that? Oh my god, you know, you got you know, and you try to reevaluate yourself and where does it come from and how do I fix this? Well, that's okay as long as you're learning from it, right? I mean, yeah, you know, as long as you don't do it. Yeah. You know, you are smooth. <laughs> like, you're 86 years, seven years old? Yeah, I'll be 87 in April. 87, yeah. and, you know, everybody always talks about how you're the smoothest man. And, really? uh, and in this conversation now, I see why. Without you having to do anything, you're just innately smooth. Well, that's very kind of you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is it, I is it I something? I don't really spend any time thinking about it. Well, I, that's that's exactly why it is, because you don't think about it. People that are smooth don't think about being well, smooth. Well, I just think of myself as the absolute idiot of all time. You know, maybe that's a good thing. Why? Well, first of all, you don't simply you don't take yourself that yeah. seriously. You take your work seriously, but you don't take yourself seriously. Yeah. My favorite actor, one of my favorite actors of all time, Marcello. Mastriani. Really? I loved him. What was it about him that you loved? He was one of those kind of heroes, I think, that he he, he was never certain. And he, he, he would get involved in situations, dilemmas, and not and try to figure out how to get out of it. He'd manage to figure to get out of the, the uh, dilemma. But but it was always the getting back to that. It's the vulnerability. It is. It is. I think you have to have yeah, that or yeah. it doesn't work as an actor. Yeah. 